There are 566 miles of flowing water in northeast Indiana, and an event happening next week wants to get you paddling through or pedaling next to the water in downtown Fort Wayne. I hopped in a kayak at Fort Wayne Outfitters along the St. Mary's River downtown to talk about pedal, paddle, and play. Pedal, Paddle and Play is Northeast Indiana Water Trail's annual fundraiser and it's a way to get uh, people out on the river that have not been out here before or those that have to see new things that maybe they haven't experienced before. This is the third year and to date we've had 300 new people out on the river participating in this event. This is only part of what the adventure is. Right. Um, you have your choice to either paddle in a canoe, kayak, or stand-up paddleboard, or you can pedal, uh, ride your bike along the greenway. And th while you're out, you're actually on a scavenger hunt looking for, um, we have six items that you are looking for while you're out there. That'll give you a little bit of history about the rivers or about the uh, city itself. I want to know, why did you get involved with this? Why did I get involved? Well, um, I have spent my entire career up to now I'm um, working in water quality okay. and what I have learned uh, over the years is that those people that actually are out experiencing the water um, participating with various things involving the water they have more care for the water so I'm an avid paddler I've been doing it for probably a decade now and so getting other people out there doing it they'll start not only um, doing more outdoor recreation and taking advantage of that, but also caring more for our rivers. It's uh, actually pretty hard to make yourself fall out of one of these kayaks on our rivers. Our rivers are really calm. Um, it's, an easy, it's an easy paddle, and the boats are more stable than people think. And if you don't have your own boat, there are a lot of outfitters out there. Um, there are seven in northeast Indiana, the 10 county region. So whether you want to do the Pigeon River, um, obviously we've, we're at Fort Wayne Outfitters, they're right on the St. Mary's, there's Earth Adventures here in town. Pedal Paddle and Play is next Saturday, June 9th. It's going to take place at Gildland Park. It is $25 for a single registrant and um, 45 for a double registrant, but kids 15 and under are free with a paying adult. And like I mentioned, you're looking for six different items on your scavenger hunt, and you come back, you get six chances then to enter into the prize drawing, and we have thousands of dollars worth of prizes. Um, and then we're having an after party at Hop River Brewery. So they've been a great sponsor as well this year, and uh, that's where the play comes in. One of my favorite ways to do an interview. Pedal, Paddle, and Play is a fundraiser. The money raised from last year's event has actually been used to launch a new website that's about all things paddling. The site shows over 80 different access points, suggested paddle trips, gear, and events. You can check that out at neiwatertrails.com. And of course, if you've never been on the rivers, you want to check out Pedal, Paddle, and Play, presented by Three Rivers Federal Credit Union. That's happening next Saturday. 